we need to talk about it no more. And instead, focus on the here and now. A match that has the capacity to delight and dazzle, no matter who. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Kylian Mbappe plays with Kingsley Coman in the wide positions. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Olivier Giroud. plays alongside Luke Shaw as fullbacks. Bukayo Saka plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. Well, he's certainly not alone. Possession lost by England. Take it away. Maguire. Another play. Kylian Sterling coming up. Henderson. We're using the space really well. But now can they push on? But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Under some pressure. himself into the attacking third with the ball at his feet. Rabio. And the course needed to be better than that one. Walker. And England being afforded too much space. Now Walker with the delivery. Cleared away comprehensively. Jude Bellingham. Short attention. but it was squandered go kick well work I think at this stage going back to the chance from earlier
Coman. And a passing sequence that's easy on the eye. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. so much of the ball in the last 15 minutes they're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat you feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination doesn't want to lose his cool here just the clearance that was called for Shaw sure. and that's how to do it inside your own penalty area Touchline for what will be a France throw. Henderson. A chance to whip it in. Well, no way through. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Giroud. Great defending. Keeper oh. with it. And so there it is. The first half has come to an end here at the Orange Veritron. It's with Giroud. Rabio. Oh, a fine block. And towards Mbappe. left for play effective challenge able to get the body in the way well it's been complete domination for France in the last 15 minutes and they're playing really well and creating chances it's surely only a matter of time before they take the lead here 
Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick, and Kane wasn't going to miss that. He knows exactly how to find a bit of space in the box. He's a great player. get the ball rolling once more we're about to find out how they're going to react to the setback Uber Mechanic Chouameni Walker England unable to retain possession and players waiting in the centre defending at its very finest high pressing at its best Bellingham France with the ball again well couldn't keep it in well both teams have had substitutes swarming up and now both will rely on their respective benches Changement pour l'Angleterre. Sac du terrain. Le numéro 2, Kyle Walker. Se remplacer. Le numéro 16, Ben Chilwell. Attentif ensemble. Merci de me signaler le moindre tourni ou comportement. Not able to pick out a teammate. And that will be a throw. Changement pour l'Angleterre. Time for a change then. Joueur sortant. Le numéro 3, Mucha. Pour le remplacer. Coman. Toro Muani. Read it well. against them they have work to do oh great vision that's clear just failing to hit the target with his pass and it will be a throw in so making the substitution now the dying embers of the game it looks as though the visitors have done it off Stuart your assessment yeah just about edging it overall it's been a really tight game hasn't it chances at a premium and you have to praise their defending in that regard just got to see out the final few minutes now no silly mistakes at the back and so into the final five minutes and France regaining possession Well, the fans are certainly playing their part here. Just listen to this noise. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. And over the touchline for what will be an England throw. Chilwell. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Trippier. And the final whistle is sounded. England victorious. Plenty of plus points. And Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances of both ends. I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. As usual, Harry Kane, difficult to defend against. What did you make of what he actually did out there on the pitch? 
Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.